What's up guys? Yeah, I wanted to uh, make another video. This time I wanted to talk about the uh, Tag Your Tires stuff. Um, I've had them on for at least a month, probably longer than that, two months, three months. And uh, yeah, you have to forgive the car for being so filthy. It really needs a bath. I'll probably do it Thursday. But um, yeah, I kind of wanted to do like a review you know, a little further out than just having them on the car for like a week or two. Like here, it's been a couple months, I think. And um, I mean, <clears throat> it's I I believe it's a good product. And um, you know, you you put them on using glue, and you know, you clean everything with alcohol, and you prep surfaces before you put it on. So you know, they're they're put on and and adhered pretty well to the tires. Um, but I still think for, like, over time, it's just, they wear down, um, well, it's kind of hard to see. Like, first of all, they're really hard to keep clean. I mean, a couple days of driving and they're already filthy. But, uh, see, there's, like, cracks in it. So even though they are pretty good material, they still, they break apart. And actually, uh, if you look, part of the R is gone, <laughs> and, it's, and it's coming off. See, some of them are coming off. I've, like every night, I would check around my car, and I would check to see if there's any that are loose, and I would re-glue it. So even though it does bond pretty well, they do come loose over time. And I'm guessing that's because they're, they're curved, I guess. But, um... What do you call it? Um, but it's, I wouldn't blame all of it on the product. Um, I think part of it is where I placed it on the tire. If I had to do it again, I would probably, because I tried to follow this top line right here. So all the tops are even with that, or up to it. I probably would have used this line and maybe put them down closer to this line right here. Because if you look, when the tires, when the letters are down, they're kind of, near the ground and if there's debris it can hit it and stuff so I would have probably made it more center than down even though I don't care about the the placement it's just I think it, it's getting damaged and that's I think part of the reason why it's getting tore up another part is because uh, the height of my car because the fenders are rolled that's why the liners hanging down and it's breaking apart and junk but um you know I, I like I like the height of my car, I like the stance, um, I mean I'd probably raise the rear a little bit, probably will later, but uh, the problem is, you know, when you hit bumps and stuff, the car bounces and it's, you know, the liner is hitting and scraping, and that's part of what's tearing it up. So, uh, <clears throat> I guess that's kind of really my review, I mean, it's, it's a good product, I think it's good, <clears throat> excuse me. And, um, you know, it's not some, like, thin piece of garbage that's made of. It's made of some pretty good, I guess, rubber-type material. It's flexible and everything. I was just really surprised to see it crack like this. And, you know, that added with, you know, debris on the road where it's placed on my tire and my ride height. It's all it's getting damaged. You know, and I'm... I like it, and you know, the effect it gives the car when it's rolling is really awesome. But, it, I mean, it's just, for me personally, it's just too much of a pain to keep up with it. You know, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to, you know, I'll continue to clean them and everything, and as they fall off the car, I'll just, I'll just let them fall off, whatever. And uh, once they're off, I'll probably take the sandpaper and I'll sand down any of the glue that's left and get rid of it and then I'll be able to shine my tires again because uh, that's one thing that I've, I've been avoiding with these is you know I don't want to get a because I have the spray you spray it and it foams it up and then you wipe it and then it's shiny but you know if you get if you get all the spray in there it might break the glue loose so I've been trying to avoid shining my tires which you know I like shining my tires See, and then you can kind of see it's all marked up from getting hit. So, 
It's unfortunate. I do like them. So, yeah. I guess, uh, yeah, that's that's basically it. I like them, but I don't know. I just, I wish they weren't getting all damaged and beat up. And, uh, you know, once they fall off or it just gets bad enough, I'm just going to take them off and leave them off. But still, I mean, if I had to do it again, I probably would do the same thing. They're, they are pretty cool. I've gotten a lot of looks and there's been a lot of pictures taken of my car because of it. So yeah, if you guys are on the fence for uh, tag your tires lettering, I, I mean if you have the money, I'd say go for it. Just be mindful of your ride height and you know where you place it on your on your tire and how well you put it put it on, and just keep them clean. All right. Well, as always, if you have any questions or anything, let me know. Um, that's it. Catch you guys later.